Hello everyone. I wanted to do a flip through for this micro mini junk journal that I did on a live stream. I made it from a coin envelope and I never did do a flip through. So it is just a single signature sewn in with a three hole pamphlet stitch. I used the twine, the string that I sewed the book together. I made extra long, attached a button to it so that I could use it as the enclosure. It is a coin envelope cover, so it's only two and a quarter inches tall by almost three inches or two inches wide. So it's kind of small. This is the coin envelope that I used. And I did take some of the glue off this flap here so that I could use it as a pocket. And there is a few pieces of store-bought ephemera in the book. I did it on a live stream, so some of the pieces are cut and a lot of them are torn. I used leftover little bits of book pages, painted papers, security envelopes, and that kind of thing. Here's a pocket, another piece of ephemera inside. I did use this Tiny Things stamp collection from Tim Holtz. I wanted some stamps on the pages, but I needed small little things and those worked really well. There's a fish in the center. So I just wanted to do a flip through and show it. A little elephant. Sorry, I am late doing that. It is so tiny, it's hard to handle. The pages are not all the same size. Here's another pocket. And I use the envelope for a pocket in the cover. And it has some store-bought ephemera inside of it. And a handmade envelope from a little piece of paper, book page, that has a little ephemera inside of it. This is the same envelope that I have videos on. I do like to make these little envelopes. This is just a tiny version of that same pattern. And it fits right there in the pocket. And then I can use that flap to make sure everything stays put. And use this enclosure to make sure I don't lose any of the little bits. So that's it. A little tiny micro mini junk journal made from a coin envelope. Thanks for watching.